Today on All About Cards, we're doing a speed break of 2011 Rittenhouse Archives, The Complete Brady Bunch. This box contains 59 episode cards, which are double-sided to cover all 117 episodes of the series, and 5 autograph cards. Now let's get to the break. Okay, here we go. 2011 Rittenhouse Archives, The Complete Brady Bunch. Um, it's a complete set, and the sets were limited to only 500 uh, sets in total. And every set will be the same. So here you go. Uh, these are the episode cards, and as you can see, they're double-sided. So you get one episode on each side of the card. And they're also color-coded according to season. So uh, this is actually the back of the pack. Um, and we're going backwards in time. So this is from the last season, and there's the second to last season. Um, so that's a nice touch, too. Obviously, looking at these cards, if you've seen the uh, Brady Bunch, it will take you back to the episode instantly. The images are so iconic. Like that one. Um, as an incentive for buying two sets, uh, while you get the, the five autographs in this box, and there they are, I'll show them to you afterwards. Um, you get a bonus autograph from N.B. Davis. So you get two complete sets and you also get one um, autograph card from Alice, which is a nice little perk. But I think in order to get that, you have to order it directly from Rittenhouse Archives. And you can find them at scifihobby.com. So here are the autographs. Mike Lookinland, Susan Olson, these look really great, Barry Williams, and nice signatures too, Christopher Knight, and our last autograph, Eve Plum. And that will do it for this box. To see a review of Rittenhouse Archives, The Complete Brady Bunch, and pictures of the cards we pulled, make sure you check out our blog and our Facebook page, follow us on Twitter, and subscribe to our YouTube channel.